Oh, here we are in Mumbai. And in this video, I want to talk about the opportunities for Mumbaikers living here in this amazing city. So I've said in my previous videos, Mumbai was a city that was based around the textile industry. It's then grown into this amazing finance and IT hub. Now, a big reason for that is because of globalization. Globalization, this idea that our planet is becoming more interconnected. And that is because of improvements in technology through the internet, where you're in a position to have a video call with someone on the other side of the world, or being able to fly to different places, or the idea of container ships being able to take any, all these pro products around the world. And that has had a massive impact on a country like India. Now, a big reason why this has had a massive impact on India is because of India's population. India's population is well-educated, it's a massive population, and it's English-speaking, and the workers earn um, relatively low wages in comparison to lots of other countries in the world. Now, this has then given opportunities for transnational corporations, these being businesses that operate in more than one country, to come and want to have their operations in cities like Mumbai to be able to grow their business and use those highly skilled workers. On top of this, governments have also given big tax incentives uh, for businesses to want to operate in these cities. And on top of that, a reason why Mumbai has grown is because of its amazing, amazing trade links around the world. And as I mentioned in my previous videos, Mumbai has had 25% of trade of um, trade going in and out of Mumbai. Some great opportunities happening there. On top of this, and sorry, and linking to that, it's also the finance industry has also created 100 billion US dollars uh, back in 2014. So, so great, um, great money has been made for India as a whole because of this globalization. On top of that, you've got the tourism industry. Now this had an amazing thing for this, for this amazing country. And you know, for me coming and visiting, visiting Mumbai, exploring these different places, being to Kerala, Agra, going to Goa next, been brilliant. And that has then generated 7% of India's GDP and has given 39 million jobs in India. So that's some great opportunities for local people in India um, to come and earn a great living. Now I want to be a bit more local and talk about the opportunities here in Mumbai, specifically looking at Dharavi. Now I went on a tour of Dharavi and I didn't actually want to do a video in Dharavi because that's not the way you should do it. I didn't want to be doing that in front of people's homes. I wanted to do it outside of that. But it's such an incredible place for, to go and visit. It is so amazing to go and see the industries that are, that are happening there. There are more than 10,000 different industries in Dharavi itself. You know, it's only 2.5 kilometers um, in diameter. There's around, they think, one and a half million people living in this small confinement. And it's suddenly an amazing place for people to work. On top of that, there are said to be 15,000 different single room um, businesses in Dharavi. And when we went there, we had a look at one of the plastic sorting uh, rooms or in this building where there were there were people that had come from rural communities working there sorting out plastic putting that into different boxes that then gets um, blended down and then organized elsewhere cardboard as an example cardboard boxes get organized the cardboard gets taken apart and gets separated the the, the 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 pins that are used to put it together they then go into an aluminium recycling area so it's amazing opportunities for the for that there on top of that, Mumbai generates 400 million tons of, sorry, 400 tons of, um, of waste every day. And 80% of that waste is recycled in Dharavi. So it's such an incredible opportunity for the people there in terms of those businesses. And it's also just an incredible place in itself. You go around, you've got schools, lots of amazing opportunities for children to get an education. There were between 20 to 25 gyms, which is something that I just did not expect to have a gym there. We saw doctor surgeries, amazing stools, food markets, all of this. It was such an incredible place to visit and explore. So some great opportunities for those people living there. But on top of that, you then got great opportunities for these lower skilled people because of this growth of globalization in places like Mumbai. So suddenly you've got um, businesses, TNCs, wanting to have some cheaper labor, some lower skilled labor that then gives these people who don't earn much money, it gives them the opportunity to then leave Dharavi to then go and work outside of Dharavi to then come back and live where they do and also gives them a chance to get a job earn an income and then their children will then get the opportunity to get an education 
and then to be able to go and live, prosper and progress as people. So this is some amazing opportunities that you can experience in Mumbai, not only for the high skilled um, workers, but also gives us social mobility for the lower skilled workforce here in Mumbai. Some great geography in action.